Yo, what is going on guys? We are going to be doing some big rank ups today. Uh, this was level up, the last level up, and then we're going to be jumping into a level up that's on right now at the live server. This is pre-recorded, uh, but yeah, we're going to be doing like, I think three pretty big rank ups today. So here's my seven star mutants. We're going to be ranking up a mutant first. There's not really anyone here. I want to take it that bad. You know, like Sauron wouldn't be bad, Emma, eh, but there's really a lot of six star mutants that actually do have my attention. Uh, and I sent it Iceman last time. Um, and I regret that. I, uh, I I was gonna do Bullseye, but I was like, you know, let me do Iceman, he's a Bullseye counter. And now I never use Iceman. So yeah, I, I should have done Bullseye. And so here I'm kind of making the same mistake again, but at least Weapon X, you know, is a, a decent defender as well. You know, Iceman, He's kind of a defender, but I don't like, I'm not really comfortable using that type of champion as a defender. I'm more comfortable using, you know, a weapon X like champion as a defender where, you know, if you mess up against him, he's going to punish you pretty hard. Whereas Iceman, you know, you just need the right counter or you can take a little bit of damage. And a lot of times you can heal that damage through other ways too. So yeah, taking up weapon flex to rank five and I do have an Ascension. So... I took him to rank five, and I think I should have just left him here at rank five. You know, I think he'd be fine. But I also pull the trigger on the Ascension here. Uh, and I also take him to max Sig. So I was looking at the Sig ability here. So the Berserker Rage cooldown duration decreases by 4.32 seconds. And so if we take this all the way to Sig 200, it is going to go to, I believe, seven seconds. Uh, so, you know, he's just, once that his Berserk... Uh, cycle ends he's just going to be able to get back into it that much faster being max sig so it's going to make him better on defense uh and so here i was just trying to figure out what stones i wanted to use kept kind of going back and forth but yeah use some extra magic sigs some mutant sigs there we go sig 200 and up to seven seconds at sig 200 so like okay cool you know that'll make him a better defender now do i ascend him and i was like yeah you know this is this guy's freaking weapon flex man you know we got him from we earned this champion from act six legend runs uh back when legend runs were were actually pretty challenging you know we i did uh the 6.2 champion that was how i got my first ever copy of wolverine weapon x that was really fun one of my favorite legend runs probably ever that was the, the 6.2 champion boss was just a blast man um, and that's how we first ever earned our copy of Six Star Weapon X. So that's, he's special. So uh, this decision, you know, it's, I kind of wish I didn't ascend him, but at the same time, you know, he's a bullseye counter, he's a good defender, uh, and he's a trophy champ and, uh, one that I earned and a really cool one. And plus he's Wolverine. I really do love Wolverine as a character. So yeah, that's our first rank up, rank five and an ascension. All right, let's go jump back in game now to do some more rank ups on a fresh level up. All right, guys, so jumping back into game now, we have a live level up, and this one would have actually been perfect for Weapon X because it's me an advancement too. But I don't really care about the advancements. It's just level up uh, that matters. So let's go, what do I have for ISO right now? Okay, a bunch of stuff. All right, so I think we're just gonna get, let, let's take a quick look at the Catalyst stash actually, because I can do, you know, technically four rank ups here with, you know, one in Mystic, one in Tech, one in Science, and one in Cosmic. However, I don't have enough basic catalysts to do four rank ups. I only have enough to, about, to do about two. So we're only going to do two more big rank ups here today. And then kind of keep thinking about some of the other ones that I want to do and just wait to get more catalysts because I could do another rank up here through the Battleground store. If, you know, I go like this for tier 6 basic and tier 3 alpha, but, you know, 16,000 each. We're looking at 32,000 trophy tokens. That's like a one third of my entire stash of trophy tokens. So for like one rank up that, you know, I'm going to still be able to do the rank up. I just need to wait like a week to get these catalysts. I'm just going to wait. So we're just going to do two rank ups today. So we're gonna get started with a seven star rank up. So right now I'd say the top options for seven star rank two are Juggernaut, he's unduped. The reason I've been holding off on this is because he's unduped. You know, I have the six star rank five, six sixty nine, you know, already putting in a lot of work. I would like to get the seven star up, but there's just really no rush for me. 
but he's an option. Then we have, you know, Iron Man Awakened, a good option. We got Penny Parker, a decent option here. Cosmic, we have Adam Warlock, who's a really good option. I've seen one tier five Cosmic, which I, Catalyst, which I definitely get. Uh, also Angela, you know, Sig 60. She's an option as well. And then we have uh, Mutants. We already did a Mutant Rank Up, so I pretty dry on those catalysts skill i think i'm also pretty dry on these catalysts yeah i only have two so that leaves us with science so you know science there's no one here that i wanted to rank up until the other day when we pulled a seven star silk out of a basic dude which was just unreal so we're gonna go ahead and boom take her up to rank two there we go rank two silk very nice let's just funnel in all that iso all right, so a fun fact, Silk was actually the first ever seven star rank three champion in all of MCOC. That's who FinTech took up, you know, after the battle on Brawl, winning that, get, got to have the first ever rank three, and he, he chose Silk. So, you know, she must be a good champion if, uh, if she was the first ever rank three, you know, that the Vancouver Victor picked as his, his top champ. She must be pretty good. I've also seen some really impressive stuff. You know, she's also a good onslaught counter, which is great. You know, onslaught is a bit of a bully in battlegrounds. So yeah, there we go. Boom, silk, taken up to rank two, level thirty-five. Awesome. I would love to get her awakened, um, but just having access to that slow would be really nice, especially for next meta. You know, it's footloose, <laughs> so slow would really come in handy there. But yeah, just good to have her. Uh, I'm sure we'll get her awakened eventually. That's awesome. There's Silk at rank two. All right, now we are going to shift our attention over to the Cosmic class, but on the six star side of things. And that's because we are going to be taking up the Serpent here to rank five. So I think I'm going to hold off this time on the Ascension, which is probably what I should have done in Weapon X. Also, I should add that I was not completely sober when I did that Weapon X rank up. Uh, far from sober. But I'm very sober right now. So I'm going to hold off on the Ascension here. Even though I don't think it would be a bad idea. We'll talk about my top transfer Ascension once this guy's ranked. But let's just focus on getting him to rank 5. Even at rank 4, dude, he has been putting in a monumental amount of work for me in Battlegrounds and Defense. Like, I don't think... I think I have lost around when I put him on D, but like he still did a really good job. He took off like over half of the health of the opponent's attacker. I just should have played better. Um, but yeah, so I think at rank 5, he'll be chilling for now. He's rank 5, Sig 200. I think that's fine. So let, let's take a look at the 6-star roster, and let's see who the top options are for Ascension. So... So far of our ascensions, we have Scorp, Hulkling, Kate. Uh, or let's just put this to Ascended real quick. So we can just see. This is who we got. We got three Mutants Ascended. We got two Cosmics Ascended. Only one Science Champ Ascended. Two Skills, uh, one Tech, one Mystic. Dude, I have so many Mutant Ascensions now. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, I should have thought about those a little bit more. But it's okay. Uh, I do regret Iceman. I would I would rank him down if I could, but Weapon Flex, man, this dude is he's my trophy champ. So it's kind of nice having him all maxed out. Plus, Weapon X is a good attacker. T Jarvis has made uh, a video showing off how many fights this guy can take in battlegrounds on attack. Plus, he is a bullseye counter, so you know that that is definitely something to keep in mind. All right, but as far as champs that we can ascend. So I'd say the top options right now are top two are Bullseye, rank five, Sig 200, and Serpent, also rank five, Sig 200. These guys are just, you know, really good defenders. So it would make sense to have them ascended. Um, and I'd say the other champ is Archangel. I feel like I probably should have just done Archangel instead of Iceman because Archangel, you know, he's so useful in like every meta. Not every meta, but most metas, you know. <sighs> Archangel is just such a beast. So yeah, that's where I'm really at for ascensions. Let me know in the comments who you guys think I should ascend. Uh, I'm 50 dust away from a second ascension as well. Uh, and I have 100 dust that I can get in... Just once I complete the Paragon Gauntlet here. Uh, there. So I'll have two ascensions. 
So, you know, I could do Destroyer, or sorry, I could do Serpent and Bullseye, but I'm also, you know, keeping an eye out for, for the Destroyer, which is, um, which I could save Catalyst for him, but I think I'm just going to use the X Magicka gem, and then I'll use the Catalyst on Jugs, but... Yeah, we're, if, as long as we get, you know, the early access bundle for Destroyer, we're definitely going to get him. We can use the X Magicka gem to take him to rank 4 and rank 5, so we don't even need Catalysts for that. So we just need to take him to rank 3, and then rank up gems 4 to 5, 3 to 4 to 5. You take him to Max Sig. I think I have uh, maxed on Mystic Sig Stones. But then the question is, who do we ascend? Because then we'll have Serpent, Destroyer, Bullseye. And I'll have two ascensions, and I'll be not f too far off the third one either. So you know, it'll 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 all come in time. Hmm, maybe I should just pick one right now. But then again, I also kind of want to wait to open the destroyer early access bundles because what if I just pull serpent on, out of there as a seven star? You know, then 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 I'd be a little bit annoyed. You know what? You know what? Screw it, man. Screw it. Let's just do it. <laughs> That's probably like exactly what I did with Weapon X2. I thought about it, and I was just like, ah, screw it. Um, yeah. Let's just do that. Because honestly, if I pull a 7-star Serpent, and I and I, I definitely just increase my chances of pulling 7-star Serpent by ascending him, whatever. You know, whatever. That, that means I got really lucky, and I got a new 7-star Champion. So, whatever. You know, if it happens, it happens. There we go. There's our rank five and ascended serpent, man. Holy fudge! This guy's a Kabam DLL champion, so I feel like it's worth the investment. And yeah, then uh, my next ascension can either go to Bullseye or Destroyer. We'll have to see. All right, Th that's a lot of rank ups in this video. Well, not even only three, but some big ones. You know, four to five and ascended, and then seven star rank two. The Catalyst stash is uh, is finally pretty low now. We're out of these. You know, I was I went from having like 40 of these like a, a week ago now to none, which is good. Finally used up my Kyla stash. And then, yeah, I can really only do two rank ups, jugs, and then a tech champ. And then, yeah, I think I'm going to start. I think I'm kind of collecting like mutant catalysts. There's still some more mutants that I would kind of like to rank um, as six stars. The mutant class at, at, at a six star level It's kind of nice kind of nice um plus oh yeah plus nightcrawler too gonna be getting the seven server version of him so and i think kabam also announced that mr sinister was getting buffed too so i'm very curious about that but yeah that is uh that is gonna go ahead and do it for this video guys let's go see where we looking at and level up oh nice crushed it 113,000. let's go let's claim all that okay all right and you know what let's just go take some of these new champs for a spin real quick let's do a little realm of legends so let's take this guy this guy and this gal let's go do some fights all right so we'll go weapon x against oh hold on i need to give him a relic before we do anything let me go give that guy a relic i think we'll give him the wolverine one that <laughs> makes the most sense i think uh it's on bishop i think i have one on archangel too or something um or iceman yeah iceman archangel all right let's just take that off put it on you and then we'll put i don't know the gambit one on archangel for now just for now okay Let's go do a couple test fights with our newly ranked up champions. It's always fun. I think I, yeah, I definitely did give uh, Silka a relic. I was doing some testing with her. All right, yeah, so yeah, let's start with Flex. Then we'll go Serpent. Then we'll go Silk. And yeah, we'll do that. Let's go. So with Weapon Flex, what you want to do is you want to build up those charges. So here we can Heavy now. That's perfect. Oh, it looks like we gained a charge on the first hit there. Usually, it doubles the charges. Um, but we got a little unlucky there. That's okay, though. I'm going to pop that. We're going to go into Berserk mode. 
And now we're gonna go nuts. So boom, as long as we heavy, we'll keep heavy in. We're gonna keep refreshing those bleeds. And here we're gonna get hit, but that's fine. Oh, he power drained us. That's, oh, and he intercepted me. That's kind of not fine, but at the same time, it's okay. And another special two. Uh, okay. And he power drained us more. <laughs> but you know, that's the thing about Weapon X. Like, look at our health. You know, we've taken, what, 9%? The dude is just such a tank. It don't really matter. <laughs> you just smash with him. So here, boom, 6 to 14. There we go. That's better. And then we pop this. Then we pop this. Alright, then we get hit. And again, that's fine here. This is what I should have done before. A little relic into the heavy. Last time I was playing Weapon Flex, seriously, we didn't have relics. So relics are actually really good for him just to create, you know, that opening to get the heavy attack off. Because you can keep his bleeds up forever. You just need to refresh them with the heavies. That's the main thing. All right, the serpents. I have next to no idea how to play this guy. So, yeah. <laughs> I don't really know what I'm doing here. But this my, I think this is my first time using him offensively. Like I said, I just put him on D. Does our heavy do anything? Uh, not really. I think I'll maybe go for a special three. Throw that. See what that does. See the animation here. Oh my, he's just beating him up. <laughs> Damn. Boxing. Okay, that's kind of cool. Okay. How's our damage? It's not great. <laughs> it's not great. Uh, but I. Then again, I have no idea what I'm doing, so I'm probably not playing him properly. All right, let's toss a special two. We have one fury buff right now. That's dealing some pretty bad damage. All right, let's throw a special one. We got fear. Oh, okay, that's doing some all right damage. Okay, we got four fury passives. Okay, we're starting to hit harder now. Okay, we're doing something right, I guess. 14k mediums, that's better. All right, let's throw this now with all these furies. Oh yeah, that's all right. That's feeling a lot better. It's feeling much, much, much better. Oh yeah. All right, we're cook. Wow. Okay, we started to cook at the end there. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, he definitely started to hit pretty hard there. All right, now let's give our girl Silk a try. Okay. So definitely very new to playing Silk as well. But I think I have a pretty good rough idea. I want to be intercepted, throwing these heavies. If only we were awakened, we could. This would be a really good matchup because we could slow him. Oh. So I think we're gonna go for the special three, so that we can stun him. Maybe I was supposed to do some other stuff first. I don't know. I think we'll just go for special three and then we'll build to a special two, get the double furies and then pop that and see what we can do there. There we go. All right, boom, yeah, I think I played that very well. Yeah, yeah, that was that was good. That was very well played, I'm pretty sure. I think all the Silk Enjoyers would approve of that rotation. That was some pretty good damage. We managed to maintain uh, our debuffs, minute 10, not bad. New champs all feeling very, very good. Some great rank ups here. Some big uh, account moves, some big deck moves. Um, yeah, I, uh, boom, another cosmic ascension there dll champion i mean yeah i already have you know kate and absorbing man ascended two other dll champs now we got serpent joining the crew yeah guys that is gonna go ahead and do it for this rank up and i guess gameplay video wasn't planning on doing gameplay but i'm glad we did that was fun taking the first spin 
it's gonna do it hope you guys enjoyed all the rank ups drop a like if you did subscribe if you like to see more content thank you guys so much for watching hope you enjoy peace out